The Tema Mpakadam project is being built as part of a multimodal transportation network designed to improve connectivity between Tema Port and the country's northern regions. It is a component of the first phase of the 1,000-kilometer Ghana Burkina Railway Interconnectivity Project, which will build a railway line between the port of Tema in Ghana and Ouagadougou, the capital city of Burkina Faso. At the commissioning of the road overbridge, a part of the project, President Akufado indicated his administration will continue to prioritize railway development as the country continues to have challenges with road transportation. Currently, the transportation of domestic freight and transit freight between Accra, Tema and northern Ghana and further to Burkina Faso, Mali and Niger is essentially road-based by Akumase, Tamale, Bogatanga, Navrongo, and Paga. This over-dependency on our road network, coupled with the lack of other transport alternatives, particularly between Accra and Kumase, has resulted in congestion, rapid deterioration of roads, and increases in road accidents. As part of efforts to address some of these challenges, the then Ministry of Ports, Harbors, and Railways, in June 2007, commissioned a feasibility study for a multimodal transport link between Tema and Buipe through the Volta Lake. The president listed some of the benefits the project would bring to the people of Ghana upon the successful completion of it. I've been assured by the contractor that the few outstanding works remaining on the project will be completed and the project handed over to government for operations within the first quarter of next year. The Tema Makbadan Bwipe Multimodal Transport Project when successfully completed and operationalized, will link the Tema port to the lake transport network, especially the north-south movement over a distance of some 400 kilometers, and open up the lake to the transportation of not only fuel and cement, but also containerized cargo and agricultural produce from the northern enclave in Afran Plains to the port of Tema and other destinations. Other economic benefits of the project include, one, reduction of pressure on the road network, including the Eastern Corridor roads which are under vigorous construction, thereby reducing their early deterioration and increasing their service life span. Two, minimization of the cost of transport of transportation of bulk commodities, containers, and agricultural produce to the ports and other destinations. Three, provision of affordable, reliable, and alternative means of transport for passengers who are not served by the road transport system along the corridor. And four, construction, operation, and maintenance works of the railway infrastructure, which will provide direct and indirect employment to a significant number of Ghanaians. Bruce Minister Kwesia Mwakwata stated the number of interventions being rolled out in the road and the railway sector. The Railway Development Minister John Peter Mewu assured his ministry will do all it can to ensure that the rail sector is developed. Reporting for Joy News, Richard Kwejenya Akon, Accra.